Hey, and welcome to another episode of Fate of the Norns uh, D20 Plus system, where we talk about some of the really cool D20 enhancements to the rules that we've added during our Kickstarter for creatures from fairy tale and myth. So if you haven't seen part one of this video where we talk about using dice to manage damage, head on over to that video first and then come back and watch this. So now this part of the, our video series is going to be talking about burning damage dice to use special powers. So a lot of these creatures here are going to have uh, special entries in terms of the abilities that they have. Actually, let's first talk about regeneration. Regeneration means you can take a die type that's already down here in the damage and just remove it from the damage pool. So rather than saying you regenerate two hit points, the regeneration mechanic actually says regenerate a whole die type. Now, most DMs are going to say, you know what, I'm going to take the largest damage die and regenerate that. That's a good choice, but it also means that if the monster has some really cool abilities with uh, like a d12, let's say down here, or a d10, you might want to have an alternate choice which says I'm going to regenerate a d6 because I want to keep that d12 in my damage pool so I can burn that die and trigger this power. So when burning a damage die to actually do an, a special effect, you're going to move it into a different section. So you can either, you know, this is a play area behind the GM screen, you could just draw some lines and say above this line you've got your damage pool so this is the damage the monster has sustained and below this line any dice you drag down here have been burned for special effects which means they cannot be healed anymore and that leads us to a very interesting design uh, situation where the game is more about interesting decisions and meaningful consequences than just rolling to hit rolling for damage and just jotting down hit points, doing some math on the side, saying, you know, I got 50 hit points, it took 15 damage, do some math, and nothing actually changes in the game. Here, everything's very visual, no need for a pencil and paper, and you could end up very quickly using these props here, do really cool things, all right? And this is how you burn dice for damage. Uh, stay tuned for the next video, we're gonna be going through the anatomy of the creature. Uh, thanks for watching.